But the thing is, is that you come in here now, you're all not, you're, you're all cool. You're all like, yeah, I'm sorry about this and that and this. But you see the thing with, uh, uh, with URP and other servers. Such with as URP, like, you got to pay to use a gun. So we won't talk about that. But we have really, yes, <laughs> finally, somebody agrees with me. Yeah. Jeez, like you really, you really sprung Radis off there. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah. Ooh. Fuck, he almost came his pants. He's, He's alive, alive, He's alive now. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Welcome to the first episode of the Roleplay Podcast. I'm your host, Navity, uh, here with Pugan, and then the asshole, yep. Raditz. You call me an asshole? <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm right. kidding. Hello. I'm kidding. I'm happy to be here. Hello. Hello. <laughs> uh, we also have as a guest on this episode, Costi. Hi. I was very <laughs> enthusiastic. All right. Actually, Costi, you got anything you want to say before we start? Uh, my, I mean, the main reason why I agreed to be here was because, like, I'm, I, I want to squash, squash, squash something. What? What was that? Sorry. What? Okay. Yeah, okay, so I want I want to try to squash a little bit of beef, if possible. If not, well then, there you go. But, no, that's that's why I agreed to be here. So. <clears throat> Alright, well that kind of goes into the first question. It was, uh, what convinced you to come onto the podcast, everything going on? If you want to just elaborate more into it a little bit, sure. Yeah, well, I mean, with everyone, with, like, Novity's videos. I mean, they're kind of funny, not even going to lie, but, like, I, uh, taking taking a moment to, like, think about all the weird shit that I've been doing against people and like the hate that I've been causing on myself it's like okay I guess I probably should show up to something like this because if not then it's not going to get any better and it might get worse but we'll see what happens and the possibility guess. for more views right, right? Oh well, no I mean technically yeah I guess that works too but hey man anything I for guess. the views I guess so um, so we're going to get a little bit, cause you were just bringing up drama and, uh, kind of the beef and all that. So we're just going to go into that real fast here. Um, you had an interview with Ark Knight 11, is that correct? Or 111? Yeah. Okay. Yep. How was that? Did that go well? It went well. Um, it was more questions about DOIJ than anything. It wasn't really anything targeted towards like me personally. So. Uh, there, one of the questions in there were directed more about, do you believe the RP communities can unite? And you pretty much were like, no, it's not going to happen. So, like, why do you believe that, like, you know, everyone being peaceful would not really happen or work well? I think with how our communities are all run, there's always there's always a mutual bad guy, it seems. And it, it every time communities try to work together, it seems there's a new bad guy that comes out of nowhere. And it's... I don't know. I just feel like it would it would be really nice to have that happen, but with the amount of toxic people and how every different server runs things their own way, I just don't see everyone being able to join into one big server together because everyone you, has their own taste of roleplay. Who do you think's the bad guy right now between all the servers? Um. Well, it de it depends on what you mean by all the servers because like well, the majority, like the larger ones. What do you think it is? Well, uh, it's either me or. I think that the name of I uh, real life roleplay or something like yes. that. Yes. Finally, somebody agrees with me. Yeah. <laughs> Jeez, you really, you really sprung Radis off there. Yeah, yeah. man. Ooh. Fuck him, was came his pants. Up. He's, like him. He's alive now. I Someone don't... told me that like the founder of real life like tried making his members pay him twenty bucks for wasting yes. his time or something like that. It's like that doesn't yes. even make sense. It's it's like, very bad. It is very bad. So this question, we took some questions from the uh, the viewers or the people in the uh, Discord server themselves, and we got a couple questions regarding this. So uh, this person asked, "What made Kasi decide to cre uh, create base side with Novity and then go behind his back and create another server?" So what happened was I I wanted to stick with base side, and I thought it was going to be like an amazing server. I had super high hopes for it, and then once we actually started getting the ball rolling. I I really I saw fast that it wasn't what I what was it didn't reach the expectations that I was expecting it to, and that had a lot to do with Novity getting hacked and stuff like that. So there wasn't really the promotion to get the server rolling. Uh, we barely had staff in there, and then Novity kind of disappeared, and there wasn't many staff to deal with things, and there was just a lot of drama going on, and um, 
there was this one kid who had like 20 alts that kept joining in on different alts and like raiding the server and i was just i got super but what was with the whole there. thing i get that part but what was with the whole thing of like you can create a server and leave a server right mm -hmm. And that's fine, like that's no problem. But to go into the announcements of that server's interview server and say, I'm making a server, everybody join this, and then post it in the announcements and leave, that that's yeah, that, fucked up. Yeah, that was not very smart on my part, and I'm actually surprised. I'm surprised it even went anywhere, because I was, after doing it, I was expecting people to just join it just to either backstage recruit to another server or just cause a bunch of drama and yeah i right away i was like uh Can you admit to was, causing drama yeah that was definitely on me this is going in with the drama stuff still obviously you said that some drama is good um why are we getting tons of reports from smaller youtubers uh pluto I and mean, we're gonna go into that in the next one uh ir llama lush bug tons of different small youtubers that are saying that you are attacking their youtube channels or going after them for no reason what, what's going I don't, on with that i don't even know where that started from because people <clears throat> who come most of those people who are saying that came to my comment section and started saying things um started talking random shit for no reason what like these people that i never heard of and then they said that i started disliking all their videos and stuff but that never happened i to be honest i wouldn't even want to give them the view let alone give them that type of attention and I think a lot of it has to do with the people who are watching that happen in my comment sections are probably going to the videos and disliking them or whatever they're saying is happening. But I personally don't feel like even giving them the extra view just to give them a dislike. Like that's okay. either way um, it helps them. So what you're saying is that the viewers of your videos are just going out of their way to go dislike it? I don't, I don't know if these people are actually even getting the dislikes that they're saying they're getting because some of them are saying, why are you spam disliking my videos and stuff? And I'll go to their videos and they get that amount of dislikes on average. Like, that's just their average amount of dislikes. So I don't know why. You know, and that, we can't that. prove that. So obviously yeah. you could be telling the, the full truth and that's fine. Um, the things we can prove are the pictures that we were sent of you going to YouTubers and um, saying just rude comments for no reason and later deleting them so that they couldn't take pictures of them or we even have proof of you taking down obviously because he made a video Pluto's video of copyright striking like that's what we're talking about with the attacking like why is that happening oh yeah I when so um, one of the things about getting people's videos like taken down is in LBRP we tell our content creators if you plan on leaving the server you're gonna go make hate videos and stuff on us um, one of the agreements to being a content creator is we can tell you to take down those videos. So we tell people, okay, you're spamming random videos about why you shouldn't join our servers and stuff like that, so take them down. And they agreed to it. They signed their name on the agreement and everything to be a content creator. And so you make people sign happens, a contract to not make hate videos? It's just an application, and by them submitting the application, they agree that if they're if we tell them, hey, you put LBRP in this video and we don't like it. Or let's say someone were to like record a fail RP incident that happened or something and put it on YouTube acting like that's like a normal session. We'd be like, we would tell them, hey, you know that's not true. Take down the video. And the situation I, with Pluto, it was just, I don't, I was getting DMs just spammed because I never even saw the video go up, but people started DMing me saying, did you see this? Did you see this? Did you see this? And I was just getting annoyed with it. So I was like, okay, I'll get it taken care of, I guess. So like, what did he say? Because you, you realize taking down people's videos is actually against the law, right? And you can actually uh, well, serve time like, for that. We got it taken down because he used my live stream footage in it. Like he was using my footage, claiming it was fair use, but it's not. It is fair use, though. It's commentary. Was it uploaded on YouTube? Was it uploaded on YouTube? It and YouTube. streams are fair use. All it was. Yeah, it was uploaded on I mean, YouTube. Let's be honest, the YouTube system's shit. Like, it's horrible. And you can easily manipulate the heck out of it. But I don't, you know, you taking down other videos use. is bad. Yeah, That's it's easy a lot of these. You realize taking, like, let's for example, you took down one of my videos. Uh, obviously, I wouldn't go down with a fight. Uh, but you took those, 
you could ruin the chances of me streaming ever again until I get that. Uh, yeah, like when you get a strike, you lose your ability to stream. You lose what? a bunch yeah. of stuff. Wait, what video credits? I don't remember. He's saying if you did. I'm just saying if you did, yeah. Oh, like, okay. like let's say you did that to a larger YouTube. You could screw yeah. them over. Like, let's say they legit made analytics. They made money off of it. They can't stream. I believe you lose your AdSense in the, like, in the near future if you get any more after that. If you get one strike, you can't monetize. You lose, yeah, your, so you lose your live stream ability. Uh, you can't. I, mean, yeah. I think you can't do community posts anymore. Shit like that. You lose tons of stuff. Cause I got like twenty seven of them when my channel got hacked. <laughs> I think it's something to do with timelines of your videos too. You can't record anything under ten minutes or over ten minutes. I think not one hundred ten percent on that one. Something in the lines like that. Is All I know is it fuck your channel up bad. And if it's if it's not yeah. needed, you shouldn't be copyright striking. It's really hard to get removed. Unless if you could uh, somewhat yeah. uh, <laughs> prove that it was a false copyright. And that's why everyone's so upset. That's why I'm trying to bring it up to you because yeah. I get you were upset, but like, there's nothing that you can, there's no excuse to why you do that to someone. Like, what's he really going to do? He doesn't have much, much subscribers. He's not going to like expose Costi. Like, there's nothing. I like, just I, that's what we don't I get. I feel like I didn't want him to get the extra attention for no reason. But he's not getting that much attention. Like, I, you keep, I, no, or all respect to you, Costi, but you keep bringing up this relevancy thing when. I'm not like there's not that many people that are that relevant in this community, and yeah, t true. to the point where they're gonna get any extra clout. Pluto didn't make any money off that video. Maybe five cents if he has had cents. He's not getting any clout off of making costume videos. Realistically, yeah. that's gonna benefit him in any way. Nor does I. I don't get any clout making videos off Chief Fat as make making extra ten cents. He doesn't get any clout off making videos on me making an extra oh, ten cents. I made a lot of money, dude. <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Oh fuck you! Anyway, like, there's we're not relevant. Like, none of us are. We're just small ass YouTubers making videos. No, you're so not relevant. I'm relevant. Yeah. You're, you're not. You're fuck relevant. you. You make shitty ass content. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> it's quality. That is quality. <laughs> Uh, his video today on the district that shoot, I was laughing. I was laughing so hard. That was. Uh, yeah, I don't watch his videos. Oh, I heard you hated my recent video, Raditz. <laughs> oh, look at that! I heard it. You hated it because I was yeah, making fun of you. This video has my. Yeah, I was reacting to diss tracks. I had to put the worst one first. Come on. Oh, worst one. <laughs> for you, so often. I skipped one of them. I don't know which one it was. It was one of Radis. I got that up and I was like, I don't like this. Haircut, man. You're over here making. At least I show my face, Radis. No, 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 no. no. At least I show my face. No, Costi. At least he shows his face. Okay. You. Do you see your emoji on this goddamn podcast? Okay. Do, do we need to go there? <laughs> It's actually a very accurate what is that? To any of the viewers wondering, that is what he looks like. There you go. That's your face reveal. Okay, yeah. You don't need to wait for 20k. Like Early face you? reveal. Who are you? Uh -oh. And why are you here? Relevant poog. Hello. <laughs> okay. Let's get back to what... Uh, what I just supposed? walked into the studio and just found you guys. I don't even know how the fuck I got here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Anyway, I forgot what we were on about. You were but, talking uh, about uh, the whole, like, striking people and kind yeah. of memes. I, like, if, if I had a word for it, I would say, like, I would highly recommend you revoke oh. that strike. Because I, I have to talk to Dingus about doing it because he's the and one if he, he, if, he, if he decided to fight it back, if he was a decent... How, how much subscribers does he have? Like 20. Pluto has no choice, no chance <laughs> of getting it on. Yeah, he's not getting it. Okay. They're not yeah, I would time. revoke that, dude. That, that's, that's screwed up. And especially being a, a new YouTuber, you're ruining his whole chances becoming a YouTuber, basically. Yeah, and like I said, I think the videos I made on you were more making fun of you than ones he did. Like, he was just kind of poking a little bit of fun at your server, and blah, blah, blah. But yeah, he wasn't going that bad, like, at all. See, it's not as bad when it's, like, against me personally, but I don't, I just, I hate when people try to go after, like, my community, because it's like, they did nothing wrong. Like, you're talking down on... 4,000 some people that have done Oh that. no, he didn't say in the video like these 4,000 people no, in this community suck ass. He I could I could believe that, but the the fact that you keep bringing up like clout and like the way it makes you look and something like that, I think it's more of like an ego thing, like more of like you don't want him to grow off of your name. I don't think it's about your community at the end of the day. I think that's kind of just your cover up and that's kind of BS, but that's just my opinion. Also another thing I wanted to ask you about, that fucking logo. Which one? The old the, one? The old what the fuck was that? Yeah, that's so Chief Nova. 
Uh, he's he was our graphic designer at the time. He was not uh, a graphic dude. designer. He was fucking Navadi's dick licker. Yeah, well, <laughs> we, <laughs> uh, we need we needed a new logo because the one that we had looked like some sort of Microsoft or Paint.net type of logo. That one so did like, too. So I was like, can you uh, can you throw us together a quick logo or something? Can you make us a new logo? He gave us that. I was like, well, I mean, ch- I. All right, I guess, but I didn't. Why did you know, use it? Really like you should have known you were instantly gonna get called out. Like you might not have get called out for it when I wasn't oh, back. No, I knew. No, I knew people were gonna mention it, but it was it was enough. Did you even see like the first one, the original? No, I came back and it saw the just, other one. It was disgusting. Which is why I joined your server and started laughing in it because I thought it was amazing. Been, like palm tree outline on Google and just add two palm trees. Like that's what it looks like. <laughs> Yeah, no, it was, our, our original logo was really, really bad. And I we also don't understand this logo, right? Because it really name... looks like E.T. taking off on the bike. <laughs> okay, but the server's name is Long Beach, but yeah. that's a forest and a moon. Yeah, no, this is, this is also very temporary. We, we don't have graphic designers, so we just had to take what we could get. And I literally just went on to random websites that I could find and looked for the best logo that we could buy. And this is what we have. Until our new one just got finished, and that's that's mm. what's releasing at two thousand. That's like the big announcement is uh, we're doing a rebranding with new logos. Kind of a anticlimactic. Yeah. Kind I of. swear, if it's another upgraded version of the last one. Can't wait for two K. No, oh, it's, another it's, logo. Watch it be just a Bayside logo with like Paint.net text over it, over it Bayside. Like <laughs> <one>. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. All right. I have- I have something what's been bothering me. I want to ask you this, and it's okay. been bothering me for a few months, all right? Okay. So, a few months back, you told me you felt bad for me. You remember that? You, you felt uh, bad for me, all those claims on me, and then you said I was actually a nice dude. Oh, yeah. Yeah? All right. And then less than, like, 24 hours, you decided to join URP, to join DYJ, and then you stated to me, blatantly, you stated to me, you're going to go make va- hate videos towards me uh, just to go somewhere in dyj like i i don't understand that so trying to um like i was trying to make any type of content at the time that i could make and when khan like came to me and he's like hey i'll let you come back if you can make videos like this and i was like i okay i i guess i don't know if i still have the screenshots or anything but like he asked me to make videos like talking down on you for a certain like higher position as a YouTuber to get like the advertiser role and stuff back. And I was like, well, that's why I'm in DOIJ because I want to make content. So, so this was Khan's okay. doing. Yeah, he was telling me to talk down on Rad. It's it's. I, I I don't understand though. Like you 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 quote unquote said we're friends. You said I was a good guy and you felt really bad for me and all that type of stuff. What was you going are on? And then like hate twenty four no hours reason. later. Like it, like you know, I'm going through a tough time. You, you, you know, I'm actually a chill dude. I was there to help you, and I was actually going to help your YouTube channel, all that type of stuff. And like literally 24 hours ago, you're over here making or planning on making hate videos of lies uh, towards me. Yeah, it was. I was just doing anything that I could at the time to get where I, because. He wasn't going to make me, like, I, there was no chance that I was going to be a content creator in DOIJ if I didn't, like, I probably, I don't know if I would have even been allowed in the server, let alone be a content creator. And at that point, because I left URP, I figured I, I wouldn't have been welcomed back into URP anyway, so I, I, I didn't know what to do, so I was... See, at, that's, that's the reason why I don't like you. There, there's yeah. a lot of reasons why a lot of people don't like you, but you you over, you go around, you make friends, and then you backstab them for clout. Like it, it just yeah. it doesn't make I, sense. I, to a lot me. of like chasing I, fame that doesn't. Friends exist. are the most important thing uh, for somebody to actually have. Friends are the people who are going to be there for you. Friends are going to be the, uh, yeah. So it, it just doesn't make any sense to me. Yeah, I I get that, and that's. All of it, it, I mean, I'm not going to try to blame it on anyone else. It's my fault. I easily could have just told Khan, no, I'm not doing that. You can kick me all you want or anything like that. And I easily could have never left URP to try to grow my channel on a different server. Like, there was, there was hundreds of things that I could have done 
that would have been more mature, more reasonable, and more respectable that I just didn't do because at the time I was just like, okay, what server can I go to and work my way up the fastest? Like, where can I, where can I make the best video to make myself on my channel look the best? And that was, that was my mindset. Like, what can I do so that I can look the best? And that's where things were really going wrong. And that's where all the hate kind of started from was because I wasn't really worried about like, what other people were doing or thinking of me or anything like that. I, I, I used to be in that uh, point as well. That's when I made videos against DYJ and Navani stuff. I did it most Fuck you. The but then, then, I, then I realized... Content, that, by the way. Uh, uh, then I realized... Ass videos. That, like, I, I'm more about... Navi's gonna call me out for this. I'm more for uh, quality and, uh, like, quality content and stuff like that. Bullshit! Not, uh, just the the uh, content what uh, I want to do for views and stuff like that. That's why I've been trying to change, like, I know you guys don't watch my videos, but that's why I've been trying to change my content and, like, start... You make videos? My, you know, my... I thought you were a porn star. <laughs> Wait, what? Fan, we got fan, the wrong Costi on the fucking I, podcast. I, I've, seen, I've seen your uh, Minecraft Diamond Tower video, yep. That's, that's... Next episode, we're going to be playing Minecraft on the... Oh, Minecraft. fuck you. Never, no, never happening. Anyway, <laughs> I have a question, Costi. So I What's someone that? sent me one of your streams you did um, this month, like last week, and at one point of the stream you're like sitting there and you're going off in your stream saying I hate Novity, he never supported my channel, he was always out for me and blah blah blah, and then you were like he only supported Pugin, he never supported me and all this other shit, and then that was it. And I was like the whole time I was saying like what do you mean I never supported you? What do you mean by that? It was like so. Like you, like I said, and I told you, I was I was looking for the community that I could best grow my channel, that like like the best quality content, the most realistic role play, and trying to be. It was like around the Bayside time when we were trying to start Bayside. It was like okay, I'm gonna try to make some videos on Bayside and stuff, and like when I would upload them or try to uh, promote them. You'd ask me to like take it out of the announcement. No, somewhere. because no, 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 no. Because you posted Bayside videos when I left. I, you had no videos up at Bayside yet when I was there. But yeah. you had the. I think it was the second day, if maybe forty, yeah, forty-eight hours into Bayside launching, you had tried posting your YouTube channel announcements with out everybody twice. And I said, don't do that yet because we had I don't know what it was, but it was an important announcement regarding the server and an actual starting of the server. And I said, I don't want people to see this, so they know what the fuck the server is about first. Mm -hmm. and we can build a server then and then i think i said this to you in the chat as well that once we get things rolling you can post it all as much as you want but it needs to be base ad related first yeah um but you had it was like you had a problem with that you wanted to just immediately start throwing your link in there because i, I my opinion i felt like you just wanted to get as many subs right off of the bat as you could off of the people that i was bringing into that server um which yeah, which is what kind of annoyed me um yeah, and you I mean you're not 100% wrong. Like I was trying to just grow however I could and wherever I could instead of more worrying about like what I was actually doing. It was just more of a how fast can I get it done type of situation. Well, it seems to me like you're bouncing to every community that you possibly can to try to grow yourself, but you're burning bridges along the way and you're pissing people off because at the end of the day it just seems like you just want to grow your channel and that's it. You don't want to actually, you know, work at making friends, things like that. Like you, you bounce to Navity. Oh, you're going to DIJ. Oh, you're going to URP. You're going back to DIJ. You're going back to your server. Like it just, you're bouncing between places and just trying to get your link out and things like that. Like it just, it seems like you're trying to manipulate your way to the top. That's, I mean, is that yeah, fair? That's, that yeah, that's fair. That's basically what I was doing. It was just, I don't know. It, it was all. I, like I said, I was just targeting for the views and like, um, I was going for. So I started doing DYJ videos. The views were good at first, and then they started dropping, and then I went to a new place. And every time that the views started dropping, I just changed places. And like every time I went back to DYJ, th they would jump again. And it was, it was just I wasn't concerning myself or like focusing on something that I should have been focusing on. I was more just like, oh, I'm doing good here. Let's go here. Oh, I'm losing it here. Let's go to a place where I can do good. And I was just. I was just trying to stay on top, even though how to you kill know. your channel one on one. Yeah, it was. It it's was how just to gain being... a bunch of inactive subscribers for the long run. You got two K now, and you're dropping like a hundred views. Yeah, 
not gonna call you out, talk crap or anything like that, but that's what's happening to your channel right now. You got to pick a home and call that your home. Yeah, and that's part well, of. Well, let's I be honest. Me. Long Beach will probably be shut down probably in the next uh, few months, and then who knows who you're gonna be joining. I don't know. Well, I like to give him the benefit of the doubt and think Long Beach is gonna last, but it's just like, yeah, he's not that's wrong. Why I don't... He's That's not why wrong. I don't recommend joining smaller communities like that. I, I recommend joining like DYJ, UP, CBC. Um, this this community oh, is what's been around for. It's going to be a big community. <laughs> well, I couldn't really think of anyone uh, else. Yeah. <laughs> the reason why me and Khan and however other owners uh, are out there get so much hate is because over time, or if there's a problem in that server, they they they. Uh, they target the owners. So then they yeah. go off and create a new community and they try to do something great, the next best thing. And I call them branch servers. Yeah. But like Novity made a great example in one of his videos um, a while back, a few, like a month or so. Was this the Chinese ago. ones or was this his actual content? <laughs> those are my good <laughs> ass. Those are some good videos, okay? Yeah, I watched yeah, so yeah. many yeah, Dr. Yeah, Phil yeah, episodes. Yeah. <laughs> no, I actually watched a couple of Judge Judy videos off your channel. You see like, the views he's getting, man? I gained I like 1.5 million Rattus views in fucking four days. Rattus was terrified. Oh, yeah, I was coming for that ass, man. I was, I was <laughs> worried about that. Right. He's going to pass um, me. But yeah, he, he said, like, uh, he, he was talking about the exact same con or, uh, topic here in his video saying, um, this leech off of our communities and, uh, they make a new community or whatever. I don't know. Yeah, like you can't really say that LBRP wants to avoid drama when it was started based off of drama. Like the whole yeah, starting like, of yeah. the server was fuck novity kind of thing. I'm making my mm -hmm. own server. Boom. That's what it was fuck started off. Fuck join us. Yeah. And like that would be a hard way to start off. And like you could stop the drama after that. But like you continue to do it. And like the thing that annoys me, I have nothing against you. We barely ever talk. Like there's no reason to hate each other. But the thing is, is that you come in here now, you're all not, you're, you're all cool. You're all like, yeah, I'm sorry about this and that and this. But like, even today you're doing it. You're going after people in the podcast chat. You're going after people in your community tab. You, you added me in your community tab, which I mean, we can go over later here, but like you're, you're going out of your way to start things. And like, but you come in here and you're acting like, oh, I don't want any drama. I'm sorry if I did anything I bad, you know, I just want to be chill. Like, why are you doing that? I, I never started any of whatever is going on with this like in the podcast server, I never did any of this. I don't know where it started. It started with Khan randomly changing his profile picture to an image of me, but like none of that was me. Like that was, I joined the podcast server because I was invited to be here and I was like, okay, so I'll join the server, see what types of topics people are bringing up. And then I'm getting tagged at two in the morning with random memes and stupid jokes that are there. Cause just, you are a meme of the People. You are the target. It used to be me, so congratulations. You're in the uh, spotlight right now. Uh, Let's see. <laughs> but uh, you you earned that title because of what you did. You are a backstabbing person who doesn't deserve to be trusted ever again. Like you're over here taking down people's video YouTubers' videos. You might even be taking out Rada's internet right now. We don't even know. <laughs> That's Seriously? why it sounds like a fucking. <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> awesome thing. Uh, I'm calling my internet provider <laughs> during the during the podcast. Uh, I'm trying to do a fucking podcast. Did you not hear what I said there, though? We heard most of it. It wasn't bad. It was like we were saying that Cost is the meme of the community right now. In all honesty, I want you to do well. I got nothing against you, but I just I find it hard to believe you during this podcast when you've backstabbed so many people before. You've manipulated people before. You've already yeah. admitted to bouncing between communities, and you've also just recently. You know, you started stuff. And in the podcast server, you're not starting anything. I worded that wrong. But just your reaction, I think that's why people make fun of you is because your reactions are so priceless. Like, you give them a reaction. Like, don't give them a... Like, people yeah, are going to make memes all the time. I'm, but I got to ask one thing. Know. So you said that the main reason LBRP is growing right now is because of this so-called TikTok. Yeah, I think that's where... Because um, my friend Matt, he's the one who owns it. He's TikTok. He's got a shit ton of joins because he started the TikTok account. Can and, I um, can I know the name of this TikTok account? It's literally just official Long Beach. TikTok, to be honest, it is a pretty good TikTok. advertisement. TikTok. One yeah, of our guys good. made a TikTok and it got like a few K views and a lot of comments. People interested in joining. How do I look up a profile on TikTok? Do I gotta go TikTok.com? 
I think. Slash official Long Beach RP. Official yeah. is it dot Long Beach RP or ours, which is pretty freaking good. And the link is not to the the server; it's to your YouTube channel. I love that. Yeah, and well, everyone <laughs> says that I'm sub botting, but I think it's all coming from a the community growing and b the TikTok. You you go to my channel to find the um to to get to the server, and not to mention like all the videos that are on TikTok are just me taking clips from my YouTube videos and putting it on there, so people see that. And if they're liking on TikTok, they go and watch the whole thing on YouTube. You ain't getting any views for that for sure, though. Like on your YouTube, you may be getting the subscribers, man, but they're you're... improving a bit. Like not a whole lot, and it sucks, but it's they're getting better. Leeching slowly. off of things is not the greatest way to grow. Yeah, you know, I'm impressed. This TikTok, I didn't expect this TikTok to be that believable, but I'm looking at it, and I mean, yeah, it's... I mean, it looks legit. It looks legit. I need TP there. for my bunghole. I gotta make sure he's alive. Okay. I mean, some of this shit's kind of weird, but yeah. Okay. I ain't gonna watch it personally, but uh, hey, the twelve-year-olds will. Yeah, <laughs> many, many young age. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't know there was a market for this shit on TikTok. TikTok is huge. There's like you can literally post a video and get hundred. Yeah, if if you want to get twelve-year-olds for your server, use TikTok. There you go. But that's the thing. Like we've gotten some of the most mature people for our at least our 5m server like there's a doj community director his name's spencer g and he joined and we asked him how he found our community and he said he found it off of tiktok like some of our best role players who are like the most professional and most experienced are coming from the tiktok account and it's obviously yeah it's bringing in some uh younger audiences that we are not really you get more views in these like. fucking tiktoks than doj does <laughs> what the fuck it's also not that hard. To do yeah, I, I, I came across a guy on TikTok um, a few weeks back, and this is why one of talk for it. It was a PS4 clip of something uh, uh, like a pursuit, and it had like a million views. I'm like, quitting YouTube. On a PS4. <laughs> yeah. If that's, you have the right hashtags, that's well. crazy. I quit. I'm going to TikTok. <laughs> no kidding, right? <laughs> Yeah, this is this is I'm done. <laughs> oh, a thousand parts to it. I guarantee you, you guys, if you guys were to post some of these, some of your funniest clips from the podcast, you'll get a huge audience for your podcast. Like, there's no doubt about it. Mm. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, we'll be TikTok podcasters. We could do we could do belly dancings in our camera. Hi guys, and sing uh, single ladies. <laughs> and then that'll the, be the... the weird thing is Pugin. I, I yeah. invited you to a podcast a long time ago. You did, and, you, and, and yeah, you you turned it down because you it was recorded. Not but didn't everyone turn it down? Yeah, I did too. All right, but I didn't like you at the time. All right. You guys are irrelevant. <laughs> oh, so now you and Kost, you're both throwing the word relevant around. Gotcha. Yeah, these yeah, are two. They're one in the same. Like, Raditz, like, passed the torch to Costi. You're quitting URP? Can we title it that video? Can we title the uh, podcast? No, Chief <laughs> I'm gonna get no, I'm gonna, no, I'm gonna put it, Raditz, face reveal. <laughs> and then I'm gonna oh show that God, fucking cartoon. You, <laughs> <laughs> you have to do a part two for his face reveal. Uh, <laughs> Follow our TikTok for his face reveal. Oh, God. Oh, my God. See, that's false advertisement. There, you guys are all getting copyright strike. Oh, uh, fuck off. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> I got one more question for you, Costi. Yeah, so up? I saw a screenshot yesterday of your server donations. Mm -hmm. And I saw this junior mod you can buy. Yeah. Oh. For your server. That's gross. Yeah. Well, you can buy staff for your server? But that's what people aren't understanding. It's 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 kind of like a trial run to staff. Mm, no. Like it's not no a, there's no way to defend no, this. No. Uh, a they have no parents, but besides monitoring the general, chat, they don't have. They don't have. You like, realize. Sorry to keep butting you in, but you you realize an interviewer, the server, uh, a moderator of a server, they're the face of the community. They all staff members are faces of your community. I'm just. I've never made a staff member pay to be a staff. Like that's yeah. Not, that's like, just fucked up. Completely opposite. That's, well, that's fucked. not even like how you. That's not the only way to get in. But I figured well, obviously. Hey, but like, oh, you want to be staffing. See, the well, thing is though, too, is your network is not even that big. You don't have 
to, or like whatever to deal with to pay for it. You know? I don't care how big you are. I don't think you should make people pay. You, to you don't. You see the thing with uh uh with URP and other servers. Well, with URP, like, you got to pay to use a gun, so we won't talk about that. But. <laughs> This spelling, right? um, oh, we bullshit. have we have we have literally hundreds of hundreds of hundreds of dollars of purchases and monthly things we have to pay for. So we for ammo. Donations up. Uh, yeah, the other I'm forty. Million. Ban you from this podcast, <laughs> you're the host of. Uh, anyway, next episode we're gonna be talking about when season sixteen will be coming. Yeah, that's the next movie. episode. Season sixteen oh features God. of URP. But no, it's just wrong. We got a lot of attention. We got a lot of attention. No, so I must no. be the oh God. Season. Not in a good way. Not in a good. Way. This is costly attention, but yeah. uh, no. I, so I've. I mean, I've season two. Me first. Your, I've looked at it from your guys' perspective. <laughs> but how I've been seeing, how I like originally looked at it when I first created is, if you're willing to donate, you know, your own money, like things that you've worked for, then clearly you're willing to like support the community and help in whatever aspects you can. And if that's like through donations, then clearly that's like that person's willing to help out the community, and that's why I try to like. Yeah, but it's not that it's it's not so much that the people that are donating are going to be a problem. It's the, it's unfair to the people who maybe can't afford to donate but do just as much work as they do. But this person getting yeah, donations more donation stuff because people who are Yeah, but let's be honest. Work. You're looking at those donations way more than you're looking at those applications. We don't get donations though. We've gotten two donations. Since well, I don't think started. anyone's gonna pay to be staff. I'm sure you won't get much donations. It's just it's stupid that, to have up in that's general. That's probably what's uh, stopping you from. Well, because I'll be donate. honest, I think everyone in here that's had to find a staff team, even Navi here and Costi, you you know, it's hard to find staff at times. Or you know, those staff work really hard. Why did you laugh at that? Hey, what? I'm mad. You laughed at that. You went Navi. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, <I was laughs> fucking Navi staff, staff team. <laughs> I had three people. <laughs> I'm, yeah, I'm going after nobody now. This doesn't cost. This is, uh, this is no, but like, nobody. why would they pay to work really hard for you know? Like, they can, I don't. It just doesn't work well for me. It doesn't sit right. It doesn't. I, that's all I can yeah. say. Really. Yeah, it's, just, I get it's that. not right. I get that. Yeah. I mean, it, but at the same time, at least you're not making them donate to buy gun and ammo. So. All right, I'm gonna make an ex. Actually, no, I'm not gonna make an exclusive video. That's what <laughs> oh, is that what you just went to expose videos, right? It's oh my That's god. It. I will bring back I'm my exposing three part series. Oh, no, fucking... you're giving too much publicity, right? It's no, I'm irrelevant. Stop. <laughs> no, I'll, I'll just make it on Nob. Wait, Nob, he's irrelevant. Oh, fuck you. Wow. <laughs> oh my god. Do we have any new YouTubers? I don't know about yet. All right, I got one more thing for you. Yeah. So this, uh, you know, this has been the meme the last couple, like about a week now. The the beard. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Sideburns. Is this beard. is this still a thing right now? Uh, currently no. Fuck. Okay. Currently. I was literally gonna give you twenty dollars or twenty five dollars to turn your camera on and shave it. On you the have podcast. to also give him staff though. With well, let, let's, <laughs> let's, let's see it. Let's see it. Turn your camera on. Well, not liking it. Like you've heard it here, guys. He just bought a razor. I had one the entire time. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh man, yeah, I really wanted to give you twenty five dollars to do that on stream. That sucks. Twenty five now. Maybe you said twenty. Navi, how much so. you want to pay me to shave my beard? I'm gonna pay you anything. Yeah, because I'll pay you twenty five dollars to get on the treadmill. Does he get ammo with the donation he gives Whoa, you? Oh, fat shaming. <laughs> I'm not even Rad, I, look I remember Navi was calling me fat and everything like that when I first met him. That's crazy. Uh, he's seen a stupid picture. Well, it's not even me. And listen, you made what a was the boat video about it. in that picture? All right, dude. I'm just wondering. <laughs> can we, can we replace boat you? Can we replace Pook? <laughs> when, like, Costi, maybe? Yeah. Episode two, Pook will not be here. <laughs> Pook has been kicked out. Con. So uh, nice no longer here. He's not going to cause any drama. <laughs> That'd be hell. <laughs> okay. Well, that's about it for this podcast, this episode. Um, thank you, Crossy, for coming on. Yep. And uh, thank you, Pugan and Raditz, for almost being late. And, uh, almost yeah. late? Yeah. yeah you said 5 p.m. I said 4 p.m. Raditz came in the chat tired as hell. Like, you can understand. Yeah, he, he looked like he popped, like, all the Adderall he had and then jumped on. It's like he stream. got out of his bed and fell on his second floor window onto the ground of his island yeah. and then swam around the island twice and came back. At 1 a.m. and then eight hours At later, we're still tired. 
you guys are talking. <laughs> All right, guys, thank you guys for watching. Uh, we'll be back again, uh, I think, Thursday next. We'll be recording again next Thursday, but uh, when it's going to get uploaded, we don't know yet, so we'll decide that out. Uh, Thursday. All right. <laughs> Thanks for telling me that now. You're welcome. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys, all of us, in the next episode. And uh, bye-bye.